What is the metaverse? The metaverse is basically our real lives as humans, our universe as we know it, but recreated in digital form on the internet. It sounds fucking crazy, it is, but it's already happening. And in addition to recreating our entire universe as we know it, we're also creating fantasy universes and games which we can actually feel like we're in with VR headsets and participate in these worlds. So the main question is why the fuck would I want to go inhabit a digital world when I have this world? I imagine a group of humans out there decided that real life wasn't good enough so we should create a digital life and essentially transcend physical limitations. As technology keeps improving and everything goes to digital, this is where the world gets really fucking scary and this is where we progress to. But let's take COVID as a really basic example. You're sitting at home, theatres are closed, no one's touring, there are no concerts, there are no shops, there are no restaurants, everything's closed. With the metaverse, for example, you could then put on a VR headset and enter a complete world, a whole metaverse, where there are concert theatres, there are open shops, there are restaurants, good luck eating that. So instead of sitting at home, for example, you could put on your VR headset, you would have a 3D avatar of yourself, you could have a 3D scan of you, that tech exists, or you could buy an avatar of yourself, you could be a giraffe or an animal, depending on what the world has. You could then tell your friends to all do the same, join, and you would all buy tickets to go see a concert in the metaverse. Now I could decide I want to play a concert, so I decide, hey guys, I'm playing a concert at this venue in Decentraland, for example, which is a metaverse. You guys could then all buy tickets, tell all your friends, everyone would come, you'd all be wearing your VR headsets, and you'd all feel like you're at a concert with me playing, and I would actually be playing. And yeah, that's not going to feel as good as the real thing. However, the brain doesn't know the difference between what's real and what's fake when it's experiencing something in real time. So even though it's not fully real, you can actually feel a lot more like you're in it than if you were just watching a screen on an Instagram live show or just speaking to family members on a Zoom. You could actually get your family to all go sit in a living room in the metaverse and hang out together as 3D renderings of themselves. It just feels a lot more real. You can also go shopping in the metaverse and buy clothes for your digital self. Yes, I realize I'm saying these things out loud. You can also play games, you can fly, you can ride spaceships, all sorts of shit that obviously we can't do as humans, we would be able to do and experience to some degree on a subconscious level with VR headsets in the metaverse. So there are a lot of metaverses building, they all have different flavors, different graphics. Obviously Facebook and Mark Zuckerberg just announced that they're going to be calling Facebook meta and that their focus is going to be metaverse. So yes, it is scary as fuck. Tech progress is happening so fast. And our lives as humans are changing day by day without us realizing. So in five to 10 years, the metaverse is gonna be a lot more mainstream and a lot more prevalent. But right now you have a few worlds building and a lot of different things to check out. Hit me with any questions in the comments. Hit that heart button. Follow for all things crypto, blockchain, and music. Hit the link in my bio to join my Discord where we chat about all these things. And come find me at Tatiana Dimaria on the gram.